EasyMont.com. Use code Q. Get 10% off right now. Stop gambling your money. Go save your money. Go get the team you want. Go have the fun you want. Go get the players you want. All right, guys, we're back. Top 10 must-have cards. These cards are going to be must-have because you're going to see the biggest difference with them now. I just did a quarterback tier list an hour ago, and I have a corner and a wide receiver tier list just done yesterday, so check those out. Everything you want is on the channel, top 10 pass rushers and so on. Let's get started. Why is Kyle a must-have? Six foot four is amazing. The range he can cover, not getting the ball thrown over his head is so important. 90 player is what you want. 90 Kade actually turns good at 6'4". This has been a problem with those cards in the past. This, well, doesn't turn. And this one does with good agility. 90 man, 90 zone. And he has good hit power. Now, he throws his sticks by himself, which really makes him even more unique. And yes, this card is super important because it gives you a discount which helps you set up the rest of your team. And with that being said, this guy here, with his size, his ability, his thresholds, and his play rec, is a must have. Next, guys, we got Mr. Douglas here. And now, 94 speed. I mean, he's zooming around crazy cod and agility, man, zone, and play rec. So, yeah, this guy here is going to be great in coverage. And I like him because, well, he gives you the discount you want. So you can really start putting a lot more like lurk artists on the field. Okay, you get you sell somebody, you get him, you get one more lurk artist on the field. Now you're getting better animations, your defense is moving a little better. And you know what? It makes a difference. So yeah, go get this card. This is the card I love. Larry Fitzgerald. He's on my team right now. 6'3. He is big, he is fast. And you know what? He actually is special because his catch and traffic spec catch, all this hits all the thresholds at his height with crazy speed. Juke spin after the catch. He has over 90 break tackle. He actually runs over cornerbacks with trucking. This guy here is different. Okay. For example, you're talking about Tyreek Hill. Tyreek Hill cannot go get the ball like this at 6'3". Tyreek Hill does not run people over. Tyreek Hill does not break tackles. There you go. This is the guy you need, not Tyreek Hill. Tyreek Hill's an amazing guard. I get it. People are going to abuse him right now in the new game mode. I get it. But this guy here is going to give you just better animations, really. And, of course, you get an X factor with him. So is that super important? No. But what is important is his thresholds and his animation. Now, Calvin Johnson has been balling out for me. People throw the ball and with his range and his height and his reach. This guy has been just doing so well. If you're running man, obviously he's not your guy, but 90 zone and up is the threshold you want. He hits it, 90 play right, crazy jump actually at 6'5". This guy here is so dependable and yes, Pick artist, flat zone KO. It gives you a discount. So discount, height, speed, thresholds. Go get it. Julio is here. And yes, this guy here is 6'3". He has good speed. He has catching traffic, spec catch. He didn't hit the 90 break tackle, but at least he gets the lower threshold. He has over 90. He has 90 cod, so he's actually going to turn well. The juke feels good with him. And yeah, and he's going to hit all these thresholds, which he's going to turn on a dime. And also means he's going to give you... All the route running abilities you want. You want short in, you want mid in. What do you want? He gets them. So, with that being said, this guy here, outside of Princess for one, is super important and he gets a really good discount. So, yeah, go get Julio Jones. Josh Allen should be on your team. Okay. You want the best user? Here you go. You guys always ask me for users. Here you go. Six foot five means his reach is going to be crazy. Good speed, good cut. And guess what? He has 90 man, 90 zone. So if you're not using him, you can leave him in coverage. So, uh, but obviously as a user, it's what you're probably gonna use him for with the speed and his height. This guy here is what you want. Also, cause he gets the lurk artist for zero, which means again, you're saving your AP, you're setting up your team a little better, and you're gonna have better animations and a better defense. So with his discount and his height and his speed, he's a must have. Now, this guy here is actually special. And you're saying how? 
I never heard of this guy. Well, let me explain. 90 power move, 90 strength, right? He's hitting the threshold, 90 block shed, 90 hit power, all that. But what's different is he's the only card in the game that gets inside stuff for one. And this is the only ability you need on your defensive line. It is a game changer and it will actually shut down the inside run. And yes, this guy gets it for one, so he's special. And yeah, he's on my team for a reason because, well, I get to save my AP and he gets the job done. Keenan Allen has been balling out for me. He's on my team right now. Play rack is speed. He's got good height, man zone, all this good catching. Yes. Uh, and I do like this KO because if you run man, you're going to like it. If you don't, I get it. But um, yeah, I think that if you're getting a card that's going to be able to help defend deep because he has good jumping as well, 94 jumping, he's going to stop that jump ball. Even in the red zone, a jump ball, this guy here is going to stop it. So that being said, he's pretty good. Now, if you're looking for a mismatch, go get Shannon Sharp. Okay, why? Because the speed on a linebacker, he's going to be most likely faster than him. But what the difference is, is juke and spin, okay? So after the catch, this guy breaks tackles, runs people over, he jukes people, he runs by people, and he gets all the animations and the thresholds you want here. The catch and driving spec catch being up 90. I know he's only 6'2", but you know what? I know there's all, why don't you just get 6'7"? Because they turn like a dump truck, that's why. And mismatch for matchup nightmare. I know a lot of people run this, but I will say he's just another wide receiver, guys, that has 90 break tackle. He's, he's actually insane. Uh, he's on my team right now, and I love him. Uh, he gets good animations, and he's not getting off my team anytime soon. So, yeah, I would definitely go give him a chance. Now, why is Will Levis on the list? Okay. Well, because he's unique. With speed and these thresholds makes him unique. Well, what else does is his discount, right? Gunslinger for one. And by the way, if you try to use this trucking and brick tackle, you're just gonna fumble. But guys, he has the thresholds, he's fast. Well, how is he better than other quarterbacks? He, well, he has a better release than Jalen Hurts. So there you go. And he has a way better release than Otto Graham. So if you want the best quarterback and you want to invest, this card's a must have if you want the best quarterback in the game. Now that's enough for me, guys. Go check out the quarterback tier list, the wide receiver tier list, the cornerback tier list. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for hitting the like button, guys. It means everything. I'll just have a good day.